Hey guys, I feel like it's been ages. It's actually probably been just over a week, but I've missed you guys. What's going on? What's cracking? Guess what? I got a job. Did I ruin that in the title? Probably did, didn't I? Goddamn future cat. Such a killjoy. So since we came back to London after having spent the summer in Finland, since then I've been self-employed, I've been doing, you know, my acting, anything and everything that I could get basically. And I've been working with Dave on projects, I've been doing like a lot of weird freelance work. But now money started to get a little bit tight, I basically just didn't want to be poor anymore. You know that feeling? So I decided that I need to get a part-time job. So that is what I did. So a few weeks ago, I started looking for work. I was kind of focusing on something quite close by, maybe something that I could walk to because I'm just a snob, I guess. So I got a interview at this shop, literally around the corner from where we live, a really cute shop. And I was really excited. And I went there for a trial shift. And let's just say that the expectations did not match the reality. Even though the job would have been technically perfect for me, during my three hour trial shift, I just very quickly realized that this was not the place for me. I don't think that the places where I have worked have had the same kind of work ethics or, you know, as this place had. <laughs> So I had a terrible time basically. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna sugarcoat it now because I, I did come home and like cried um, and Dave was just like, okay, you're never going back there again. So the next day I was, as you can imagine, feeling pretty blue about all of this and kind of getting desperate for a job. So what I did was <laughs> the oldest trick in the book. I emailed all of my old colleagues and literally said, guys, I'm desperate. Do you have anything for me anywhere, in any shops, whatever, I don't care. And because I know the most incredible people in London, they totally came through for me. And within 48 hours, I was already on my way to work. So that all worked out pretty damn well. <laughs> and what's really cool about this whole thing is that now I am actually working in the same shop that I used to work in three years ago. It's pretty weird and pretty amazing. And they're absolute superstars for taking me back. So I must have done something right the first time around. So I'm gonna be working part-time in this shop now. I'm gonna be doing about maybe around 20 hours per week, uh, which is kind of the perfect amount. So it's about four days a week. Gives me time to go on auditions and, well, if I would ever get an acting job again, you know. But I'm actually only gonna be working there until the middle of June, because then, um, um, <laughs> I'm kind of gonna go back to Finland for the summer again. Basically, my friend whose shop I worked in last summer, um, they got in touch with me and they were kind of like, you know, Kat, we can't find anyone as good as you. Would you please do us the huge honor of um, coming back and working with us again next summer? You know, it wasn't maybe exactly those words, but I'm, I'm paraphrasing, you know, it's. it's roughly what they said. And uh, obviously I pretty much jumped at the opportunity of getting to spend yet another amazing summer in Finland, getting to spend time with my friends and my family, uh, living with my parents, which means free food. <laughs> and yeah, it's gonna be really, really cool. They will be joining me again in Finland, not for maybe the whole summer like we did last year, but for most of the summer. So that's gonna be really, really awesome. And yeah. I think that was pretty much it. I hope you enjoyed this video. It was a bit uh, just informative, I guess. Just want to keep you guys in the loop, you know? You're you're part of my like everyday life. I feel weird not sharing things with you. Do you know what I mean? Yeah? And can I just say that I absolutely friggin' love when you guys comment on my videos, so don't ever stop. Don't think that I don't care or that I don't read them. If I haven't responded to your comments, please call me out on it because it is absolutely my intention to reply and respond to every single comment because I flip and love it when you comment. So, mm. okay, I can feel that I'm getting a bit like jiggly and, and weird as I always do towards the end of a video when I've really like gotten into it, you know? So <laughs> we're just gonna stop here. Guys, I'll see you again soon. Bye.